Yeah! <laughs> Welcome back to Sonic Adventure. Every time you stop the game and come back and select a character, you get this uh, little text crawl pretty much saying exactly what's happened in the plot thus far. Nice little recap if you haven't played for a while. It's like we need Sonic reading this. So now I'm off to Station Square! That's right, those hub worlds are mondo cool! <laughs> Attitude! So, last we left off, we did stuff in the Windy Valley. And we just came back from that. <laughs> what was the point of going to Windy Valley, by the way? It was Tails, he wanted to show us something, which was that wind key, and then we checked it out, and now we're done checking it out, so now we're gonna go do something else. Well, we got a Chaos Emerald there too, remember? Oh, yeah, 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 that's right. Yeah, That, yeah. that was the was, uh, whole reason we even went to that place, gotcha. Alright, so, we're gonna head to Station Square again, because we need to be there for this next leg. Is there... Off we go. Is there a lot of backtracking like this? Well, yeah, but the stages are small enough that you don't really have to go too far. Yeah, I noticed the, the hubs are nice and small, so when you end up in Station Square, you don't really have to go very far. Yeah, I mean, th they're expansive, but all the main things are located and, you know, pretty close together, so it's not like you're lost or anything. So? That little hint puffball works wonders as well, to let you know where to go as well, you know. So hey, you know, it's moving along pretty good. Are we actually doing a sewer level? No. Okay. We're just going into the sewer because we gotta do a couple things before we go to the next stage. This first part is optional, next part- well, this this first part's required, next part's optional. So, yeah, let's head up here. To the exit. And what's that? <gasps> Whoa! Another staple of the modern Sonic series. Now you've got light speed shoes. Oh, okay. This is where it all began. Really? And it's worst integration ever. As long as there's a trail of rings, you can go just about anywhere. Okay, so this opens up a bunch of shortcuts in the later levels, correct? Now that you can light speed dash? No, eh, not really. This is just, uh, well, sometimes you can get shortcuts, but namely, what you normally use it for is, all right, here's a, here's a line of rings, charge up power, and then go up them, like so. <laughs> Zoom! It goes very fast. So now we have what we need to go into the next stage, and, uh, oh, what's this guy doing here? Okay. But you mean the door you just came out of, right? Yes, because at least Don't go sewer. through that door, I'm hiding an item back there, oops. It's dirty. <clears throat> well, uh... Like I said, we have everything to go into the next stage right now, but there's one more thing I'd like to get before we do so. Oh my gosh, I just realized it got dark. Does this have a night and day cycle? Not really, but it does pr progress, I suppose, because the casino only opens at night, and the casino's where we're going next. So, what we do is charge up, open that, and then go, and then inside, and there we go. <laughs> Holy crap! Oh! Crucial item, I'd say. This is the crystal ring. This reduces the time needed to store power for the light speed dash. Ah, uh, okay. So now it's like half as long. Ready? There you go! Very nice. So now we're, like, doubly ready for the next stage. Let's do it. Let's, the casino zone? Let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. The casino zone. Yes! I always love when Sonic games do casino levels. They're so cool looking. If it seems I'm just, like, going from one place to another, the hint balls will tell you exactly where to go and what to do, so... It's, it's part of it. So do that, and then you go in stage three! Time to gamble in Casinopolis! Eh, well, it's not really that kind of gambling, really, but... Darn it! Yeah. This is probably the most unique level of at least Sonic's portion. Essentially, we need to get 400 rings 
to get the Chaos Emerald and win the stage. This is gonna be the longest stage because there's so much to do and I want to show all of it off. I mean, if you know what you're doing, you can beat in like five minutes, but it's probably gonna take us about 15. What? So you actually have to gamble and get other rings. No, 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 there's no gambling like that in here. This is this is an E-rated game and they wouldn't allow gambling on consoles like this and without causing a huge fuss. True. E even back in the 90s, this stuff was still taboo, so uh... There's two things we can do in here. We'll head- there's a card and a slot. So, uh, I guess we'll head into the card first. And... it's Knight's Pinball! Whoa! That's really cool! Knight's fucking Pinball! This is like I didn't think Sega normally referenced their other games. Are you kidding? Well, Sonic Team, they do it all the time, but yes! Sega references their shit all the time! Hell, you can play Virtua Fighter 2 in Yakuza 4! Dude! Shit! And I, I think I lost two balls on that one. Did you see, did you see that? I lost two balls in a row. <laughs> is that another glitch? I think. <laughs> it, it might be. There's really a lot to this pinball board. There's there's two pinball boards in this stage, and this one is the most complex and uh, the more preferred one, really. It is just try and get as many rings as you can. This is how you get 400 rings. And uh, oh, be sure that you get at least a hundred before you go before you lose all your balls. You know, because if you mm. don't, something terrible will happen. <gasps> your bookie will come collect. Uh, <laughs> in a sense. <laughs> oh no! Uh, you can just see a, a cu couple guys in like uh, in like pinstripe suits just coming in and say, "Where's my money, Sonic?" We'll get to that later. Right now, let's talk about the gimmick for this board. Uh, it's card based, and essentially, you collect five cards, and once you collect the fifth card, it sees if you have anything. So there, I had two pair. I had two different cards that matched. Though so four different cards that matched twice, I guess. You know, two pair mm. work, So. The higher of a score you get, the fuck. <laughs> oh no! Well, uh, we'll come back to that later, actually. They came with baseball bats. Sonic, protect your knees! We got over 100 rings, so we're good on that. And, uh, let's see, we got tickets. Where is this? No, nope, nope, not in here, not in here. That's for later. That's Question. For later. Answer. After you finish a mini game like the pinball, are you allowed to come back? Yeah, you can, you, you can go back. Oh, okay. You can indeed go back, yes. In fact, it, it counts on you going back. Oh, well. <laughs> There's lots of ways to earn rings in this stage, because you have to earn those rings, so that way we can... Well, there's a Chaos Emerald right there. Step on this button, and, well... Oh, they're hurting Sonic! Essentially, we have to garner enough rings so that way we can reach the top. Can't Tails just, like, throw a couple rings in the air and you lightspeed dash up there? Well, it says you have to get 400 rings, but I've gotten up there with, like, 350 before. If you just mm. do your maximum ass jump, you can do it. Alright, here's the next one. Sonic Pinball! Oh, look at that! I don't like this one too much. Is it too fast for you? No, it's, it's quite the opposite. It's too slow. Oh. Wasn't that kind of ironic? Yeah, it is. Because what happens is he just gets trapped behind there and just... Ugh, so much <laughs> waiting! What the hell? Ugh. I also noticed you get a slot machine with this one. Yeah. I would show up the slot machine, but you pretty much know how it works. Let ah. me guess. Uh, Robotnik or Eggman, whatever, you lose rings. Tails, you get like half the rings, and Sonic gives you all the rings. And is there a lucky seven in there? I uh, don't think so. Really, I'm just demonstrating what happens when you don't get a hundred rings on a slot, because fuck this board. Uh, it's so slow, and there's, like, so much empty space going on! What the hell? Yeah, they could have at least, you know, put a couple more bumpers in there, just to make it... Just to make it so that you're not wasting time waiting for the ball to come back down. Of course, Sonic's board has to be the one that sucks. Alright, here goes! For real this time. You get thrown in the dumpster if you get less than a hundred rings. <laughs> I'm sorry, we don't allow poor people into Casinopolis, Sonic. Get <laughs> out of here. Sorry, you demonstrate light speed dash in practical use. 
Holy crap, that was awesome! Yeah, yeah. You can do it a lot easier in Sonic Adventure 2 and later Sonics. So you can just go up to a line of rings and just press a button and boom, there you go. Well, from the looks of it, they put down they put down a lot of rings in the trash bin, so wouldn't it be easier just to go to Sonic's immediately, fail, and then come down here? There's many ways to, fit, to uh, get rings in this level. But the easiest way is to want, use the pinball ones, because this one doesn't last very long and it only has so many rings. Hmm, okay. But it's a way to make sure that uh, your venture was not all for naught. See, we've already got way more rings than we did from the Knight's Pinball board alone, so hey, there's that. I could just imagine, like, Sonic's walking around down here and he sees a bunch of skeletons of other people who didn't make it in pinball. But! Oh, no! On the reverse side, this is also a far more dangerous path to take, and you can get <laughs> hit by any one of these spike, spiked balls or spiked spikes and oh, lose shit. all of them. Oh, that's terrible. So be careful! You don't fuck around, man! It's 3D Sonic, a whole new dimension <laughs> to kick your ass! Welcome to Casinopolis. Oh, that's that's nice. As Tails just backing away slowly, <laughs> like, do I really want to see this? Camera is not really cooperating with me right now. <laughs> you kidding? It's doing everything for you. All right, um, let's go uh, cash in real quick, and then we'll go back to the Knights Pinball and get our remaining rings. Is that everything that you can do? It's basically all just pinball? Yeah, pinball or in the in the garbage with you. <laughs> I still love that concept. You didn't get enough money, well, to hell with you. I think she warned you. It's like, make sure you get at least 100 rings. Because <laughs> if you don't... You don't want the bad men coming after you. They'll break your kneecaps, they will. <laughs> you actually get characters from Yakuza come in. <laughs> Where's that blue hedgehog that owes us money? I think this predates Yakuza by at least a few years. Damn it. <laughs> Crossover of the century. Start be... bashing Sonic's head into the Knight's pinball. There is a Sega store in Yakuza 3, uh, Yakuza 4, though. Oh, wow. Is it in Akiba? So it takes place in that. Yes! So the, it's the actual Sega store. Yes. It, it, yeah, the actual... You should play Yakuza 4, man. It, it's... <laughs> I should! I only see good things about it's it. It's very immersive. It's very immersive. There's actually a whole second part to this uh, pinball board. I haven't even fucking shown you yet. So. Two pair. That's a good way to start out. And, uh... There's a blue panel that just opened up at the back, you see. Oh, uh, yep. We're gonna try and Aww. go for that. Yeah. Sorry, we get let in on the second try. Whoa! So. What happened? Ah, shit. If you drop down, we get to this little scene. Okay, what did I miss? Oh, you're actually playing knights! Just a neat little thing. Having never played knights on the Sega Saturn because I never had a Sega Saturn, that probably would mean more to me, I guess. I mean, I love the soundtrack. It's fucking rockin'. All right, let's try and get some more rings. We need, uh, I think, what was it? A little over a hundred, I think. Yeah, at least a hundred and one more, because I had like two ninety-seven. Yeah, so we need like. Let's just get like two hundred rings. Safe bet. You know what would make this episode that much more just triumphant? Ah! Not that, but uh, getting a royal flush on the very last thing. And what happens here? Where's that coming from? Uh, I, I don't know. It's probably a scene from Knights or something, but this is like a place that has a lot of cards, so, you can, so if uh, you're careful and uh, lucky, you can get a lot of cards here and get a lot of hands. Or you could just fuck up like that. <laughs> Go straight back into Knights World. So, and so, I and so when you get pissed off, you can do the flippers and it uh, sends you all over the place. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm just thinking the owners of Casinopolis actually caught Knights and uh, making him or her work underneath the casino with the pinball machine. <laughs> if any human-sized hedgehogs come in here and they want to play, you entertain. You understand? He just bows. That's all he does. <laughs> all right, so we got to get a couple more rings. And, uh, okay, yeah, we're good. So we can probably stop now. Yeah, we're good.
Yeah, we got enough. Junk hand. A few more flips in case I got any in me. And then we'll just go ahead and... Uh... Gambling your life away. Sonic style! And there we go. <laughs> that, that was kind of the equivalent of the uh, the flippers just like flipping a table. It's just like, whatever! Don't you hate it when you're playing pinball in real life and the ball clips to the, to the fucking flippers? Oh, it sucks. Every single time. That's why I never do it anymore. Oh, I hate that. Pinball wizard? I think there's some wizardry in the pinball. Yes. Oh, we didn't see your final ring count. Oh, who cares? <laughs> it's, I care. It's fucking yeah, zero. Look at that bad. score. <laughs> that is a score of champions right there. Oh, man. We fought so hard. We fought so long to get that emerald. Uh-oh. I wonder what's going to happen now. I don't know. I actually don't know. Oh, hey, look at that. An ice key. <gasps> the ice level next. Yes. Yes. So I guess we'll head there now. Yeah. We made a killing, Tails. Hey. That's how you always leave the casino with no rings, right? Oh no, the chaos <laughs> And then you get oh, mugged no, for what you, you have don't. left. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you get knocked out in front of the casino, never to be seen again. Just lying in the street. Small violin plays. If I had a nickel. Oh, man. What happened to that emerald we Sonic's, just had? Sonic's pupil is way too far to the right of his eye. Uh, I guess <laughs> he has a death them. stare, for, specifically for Tails, when he asks death. stupid questions. That means his to R1, and that's not good. Come on, Sonic! We need to get busy! We need to get hmm. uh, floating off the ground. Jeez. Alright, so we'll see you next time on Let's Play Sonic Adventure! Later!